Africa currently boasts the lowest social protection coverage globally, with only 17% of the continent's total population benefiting from these programs. This is in stark contrast to the global average of 47%. This deficiency can be attributed to the prevalence of the informal economy and inadequate investment in social protection, which on average amounts to less than 5% of a country's GDP. This lack of adequate social protection hampers the continent's ability to reap the manifold benefits such programs offer, including poverty reduction, vulnerability mitigation, combating malnutrition, formalizing informal labor, and eliminating forced and child labor particularly in the aftermath of the COVID-19 pandemic. An action plan has been put in place, the Africa Regional Social Protection Strategy, spanning from 2021 to 2025. The Africa Regional Social Protection Strategy, therefore, addresses the root causes of coverage deficits on the continent. It also aims to support the adoption of social protection policies and strategies in African countries where there is no comprehensive social protection framework. The seminar recognized the exacerbating effects of human-induced climate change and extreme weather events on people's livelihoods and overall well-being. These factors pose significant challenges to existing social protection and security systems. And I think there are three issues we have to tackle in this seminar. The first is a set of issues related to the poverty reduction. And the second is a set of issues in terms of building an effective social safety net system. But first assess to enhance the ability of social protected institutions to continue providing services uh, to workers and at the same time consider reforms in the labor market, especially in response to the impacts of COVID-19 pandemic and to promote direct inclusion of people who are currently outside social insurance and social assistance programs. In response, countries have been urged to fortify their social protection systems to enhance preparedness for unforeseen future events and to bolster resilience. The seminar served as a platform for discussions on a wide range of social welfare challenges facing Africa and explored potential remedial actions to address these pressing concerns.